Greetings, humanoids of the ocean. My name is Bob, uh, and this is Raft. Uh, now, um, uh, I'm doing a little review of Raft just because I can't, I can't figure out, well, one, because I'm in the quarantine like the rest of the world is, uh, and two, I uh, can't figure out why it is I love it. Uh, because I do love it, but, but it doesn't seem like I would, you know? It, it's, I, I've never played Minecraft, strangely enough. Uh, but um, people have called it Minecraft of the Sea, you know. Um, anyway, it's in early access. Uh, it's been in early access for two years. Um, and basically, you, you start off uh, on a raft and collect materials to help support your life and your lifestyle um, on the ocean, floating on the ocean. Uh, now, I'm not playing the game right this minute because I find it... Let me uh, Let me turn the music down. There we go. Uh, I find it uh, difficult to um, uh, to focus on explaining the game to people and playing it at the same time, especially um, at the level of my current save game, which I'm uh, things have gotten pretty complex. Uh, so basically, I mean, the premise is you're on a uh, two by two meter square uh, pl uh, raft in the oceans where you start off, and you have to get your own food, your water. Um, uh, you have to, to, um, get other accoutrements to your survival, a spear to fend off the shark that wants to eat your boat, uh, and, uh, so on. Uh, so we're actually going to start up a, a quick game. Um, but I, I really do like it and I really don't know why. Um, because I think in, in, on one level, it's kind of a simple game. There's, there's no story. Um, there's really not a whole, once, once you get into late game where your survival is not really an issue, uh, there's not actually a whole lot to do. Um, but I mean, even then, I find it very enjoyable. But one thing is in late game, uh, there's kind of a laid back vibe to it. <clears throat> you just to kind of get kind of just stand there and fish and keep the shark from eating your boat uh, and um, and just chill. You know, it's kind of cool. Uh, not not a, not a vibe you get from many very many games. Um, so without further ado, let's start up a new world. I would go with easy because on uh, on easy when you when the shark eats you, uh, you don't lose your stuff. Also, if you want to, if you're not playing with somebody, <coughs> excuse me, if you're not playing with somebody and you want to be able to pause the game. Uh, set this to nobody can join. Uh, if you don't, then you can't pause the game without just exiting to the main menu. Uh, so if you're playing alone, I've never actually played it with friends. Uh, you can, but uh, but if you're playing alone, set always set this to nobody can join so that you can actually pause the game. And create world. I hope you're all doing uh, well in this uh, strange times um, we live in. What's the old um, uh, Klingon adage? I hope you live in dangerous time, in, in interesting times. Well, we certainly do that. Uh, I'm actually uh, was actually in the middle of trying to move to a farm um, when all this sort of shit came came down. So uh, that's kind of been put put on pause for the moment. Um, still hoping to get get out there and get things started there. But I saw. I actually kind of, kind of always knew that that something like this was going to happen. That's why I was moving to the farm. But unfortunately, I wasn't moving fast enough, and so it sort of caught, caught up to me. And uh, my sympathy and prayers to those whose uh, livelihoods are disrupted by this. Anyway, let's get to the game. All right, we see we're on a, a two by two raft, and we have this hook. And shit is floating in the ocean. Uh, th this indicates that our direction of travel. So our d d direction of travel is this way. This is plastic. That's the shark. That's Bruce, the shark. Uh, and you shouldn't be that afraid of getting in the water with him. One trick is to... Um, uh, when you're underwater, go all the way up and then jump, and you can jump free of the water. And actually, Bruce can't get you when you're out of the water. Uh, 
All right, our first priority is going to be, and it always takes a while to open the tab but for the first time, <clears throat> our first priority is going to want to be to uh, get a simple purifier and a cup. And we don't have nearly enough stuff for that. Also, if you see a barrel, barrel ha barrels have many kinds of stuff in them. So if you wanted to jump in and get get that ah, shit, if you wanted to jump in and get something, that that would be the thing you'd want to jump in after. All right, see that bottle there? That's also plastic. Come here. Yeah. Fuck you. You can get more than one thing on the hook. Uh, so if you manage to uh, navigate the hook to where... Ah, shit. I missed that one. I missed that. Uh, what we're mainly keeping an eye out for is barrels. Barrels give you a large number of things all at once. Ah, see, I got two there. <coughs> ah. Ah. Had all of them n nicely lined up there. And that's somehow I managed to just screw that up. Whatever. And we are heading toward an island. What we don't have, however, is we don't have a anchor. So if I hop off, I'm going to need to um, kind of move fast because uh, uh, the boat won't be tethered to the ground. I don't have any stone now, do I? No, I don't. Okay, here's some uh, barrels coming up, and if I think fast, I can, I can. If there's stone in them, there's some, which there sometimes is. That was that was pitiful. I'm not going to be able to reach that. Well, not maybe we'll reach it with a hook. Let's see. Nope. We're jumping. Yep, see, shark got me, but it didn't take off that much the health, so nothing to worry about. Ah, now it will. Fuck. Oh, I got one stone. I don't think it's going to be enough to do squat. Uh, anchor. Uh, I need four stones in order to make an anchor. Uh, how much do I need to make an axe? I need three stones to make an axe. All right, well, I guess we're just going to bump into this and see what happens. Uh, down here... You see how there's all sorts of resources. Uh, you have to fight Bruce for the resources unless you can get to the... Like, if you're sometimes if you're on the other side of the island... Ah, shit. Come here. Eh, whatever. All right, so we've just run in flat into this island. Now, imagine that it's going to... Uh, Let's go ahead and uh, we're going to hop on the other side. Nope, nope. Bruce is on the other side. We're going to hop on this other side. You don't want to lose your raft. That would be bad. And then the, the only thing you can do is die. And as you can see, I'm using up oxygen here. I guess what I should really be working, looking for most immediately is the stone. 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 I mean, I need all this shit. I need everything. But uh, what I need most immediately is stone. Uh, 
That shit's going to be useful later on. Not, not so much now. Up oh, there's Bruce. Uh, there's copper, which I and metal. I would like to get that, but I don't think Bruce is going to be that happy about me having that. Stone. Stone. Please. I need stone. Up oh, there he is. How did he not bite me? Fuck you. Alright, now for these things I'm gonna need to get a axe in order to cut shit down. I don't we don't have any stone. Yep, nope. Bruce is just all over this place. All right, well, let's just see right quick if there's any, like, uh, a watermelon or pineapple, something I can use to assuage my hunger or thirst immediately. Uh, flowers, all these, see all these flowers? Absolutely useless at this late stage of the game. Later on, you may need it either to die, make dyes or to, uh, uh, or to uh, raise bees. But for right now, ah, oh, watermelon. That's what I'm talking about right there. Sometimes these islands have chests on them. Uh, ooh, pineapple. Uh, sometimes these chests have islands on them. Our islands have chests on them. Uh, this one doesn't appear to. Uh, Brucey, where are you at, Brucey? Don't bring me down, Bruce. Ah, oh, fuck it. There he is. He's going to bring me down. Again, I don't need this now, but I will sometime. Uh, this is just useless. I need to need to get plastic and, and get a paddle. Yep, I uh, timed that not quite right enough. All right, screw this. I need to get a paddle. I need to get out of here. All right, that is. Whoa, you motherfucker! Uh, we need to have a spear for that. I don't have a spear. I don't have enough plank. I'm about to lose my plank, my raft here. I uh, just one short on the the planks. Damn it! All right, here I am, Bruce. Come meet me. Yep. Health just just regenerates. You don't have to really worry about it. Just sit on your raft for a while and uh <coughs> All right, we got a spear. Motherfucker. God damn piece of crap he is. All right. At this stage of the game, you can't control the uh, the the yaw, the attitude of your raft. Uh, that that comes much later on, uh, and it doesn't really actually matter that much. Um, I mean, it's it, it's it's nice, but it's not essential. You can you can find ways to working around the fact that your your raft is always going to change. Attitude on you. Oh, I need a uh, a building hammer, for which I have no planks. Uh, and it does get dark, and when that happens, um, I mean, in the, the later of the game, you can make beds that will allow you to. Um, 
to sleep during the nighttime because it's kind of hard to see. Fucking Bruce. Yeah, building hammer is something I would definitely need to have. <coughs> Planks. Now, you may find it hard to even see anything in this video. And trust me, I'm not that much better off myself. Ah, fudge. What I need right now is a barrel. Oh, barrel. Should I risk it? I don't think I'm going to because it's nighttime and I may not even be able to see my own damn raft. Alright, can I make a... Oh, jump one short. Come here. Alright. Yeah, you can, if you need stuff that you have supplies for, you can, you can build it right there in that, with that plus button. Okay, and what I was going to do with the building hammer is replace that block. There we go. And we can actually, once we get parts for it. Ah, shit. Ah, shit. Well, let's get one of them. Barrels! Ah! Oh, fuck it. Come get me, Bruce. Yep, he got me. But you see, my health had already gotten gotten back up from my previous attack, so I'm I was in good good shape. Don't bring me down, Bruce. All right, now we need to see about that water purifier thing. Simple purifier. I need more planks. Nah. Don't bring me down. Bruce! Let's see. Water purifier. All right, here's a pro tip. Never put something like this all, all the way out one square. Because if you do, if you lose that square, you're going to lose it. So put it in but at least between two squares or something like that. I may actually... Uh, yeah, at least between two squares. That way you won't lose it if, the, if Bruce noms on it. Which he is very prone to do. And prone to nom on you. Fucking blueprint. Get out of my way. Out of my life. There you go. What is that? A blueprint? Uh, antenna. Great. Okay. Whatever. I don't need these seeds right now. Let's go ahead and toss them. Um, managing your... Uh, oh, I need an uh, empty cup. Craft. What you need a cup for is you need to fill this up with salt water. So 
so you can make some um, motherfucker. I got a speed for you now. I thought I do. Damn it, two. Ah, what the hell happened? Oh, cause I, I was pulling this shit in. God damn it. There you go. Yeah, you definitely want to repair rather than uh, than replace, because uh, uh, if you repair, it only requires wood. Uh, if you if you replace, it requires wood and plastic. So always repair. Uh, and my uh, hook is dead. Need more plastic. Where's my fucking raft? Here it is. All right. Shit. <clears throat> Most of the time, unless it's a barrel, it's not worth going after stuff that's behind you. Just because it's 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 receding at a a, a point where uh, it's kind of futile. And we got barrels right here in River City. Uh, there are also sails in this game. Um, paddles are more effective than sails, but uh, sails don't require that you uh, that you actually do anything with them in order to get them to work. Uh, but it's w worthwhile to uh, use it if you need to get to a raft. You'll you'll see. I don't see any rafts around now. But if you see a raft, it's worthwhile to get to one because it'll have lots of loots. All right. Now let's see about that grill. Simple grill craft. Uh, you can catch fish if you have a fishing pole. Um, I think I probably just have beets. But that, uh, cooking it provides more nutrition than uh, just eating it raw. Which, I mean, you can imagine eating a raw beet wouldn't be that nutritious. There's a barrel over there. Uh, and uh, it's been my my experience that uh, oh water hold on they pick up salt water you put it back in there keep it going and keep planks on it it's been my experience that this is not actually an exciting game to watch it's fun to play but it's not not that interesting to watch so I'm probably gonna wrap it up here I do I do enjoy it though. I can't for the life of me tell you why I enjoy it. I guess this is why some people get get uh, all, um, you know, uh, wrapped up in Minecraft, I guess. It's just um, uh, the OCD aspect of, of it, I guess, is one thing. Especially later in the game where you have to organize all your shit. You have so much shit and you have to have storage. You have to organize your storage. There's a certain OCD aspect to that. All right, well, I guess that's all for right now. Uh, and until let me oh, oh let me show you let me let me show you uh, Bruce close up just so you can appreciate his um, his uh, full uh, grandeur here. You gonna catch it? There we go. All right, where are you at, Bruce? Here's Bruce.
Yep, that's a shark. You can kill Bruce. Uh, oh, that's a uh, thing I should probably, probably should mention. That the most efficient way to uh, kill Bruce is uh, you go to an island and you uh, uh, get a fishing pole and you start fishing. And you fish for these two different two um, types of fish um, that that you um, need in order to make uh, shark bait. I think it's like a raw herring and uh, pumpkin are the two kinds of fish. And you can have two of whatever, whichever you, of those you have. If you have two herrings or two pumpkins or one herring and one one pumpkin, uh, will work fine. I'm I'm just uh, barking up a tree here. Eh. Uh, either those will do fine, and I guess you need some rope as well. And you make shark bait, and the shark will continue to go back to that bait uh, to try to eat it. And then you, uh, if you like, drop it like right here, you can have your, uh, your spear ready and stab him as he comes to get the bait. And after about 14 times of that, you will actually um, um, kill him. And then you can get, there's like, uh, you get four, four shark meat and a shark head. Uh... Hi there, Bruce. Yeah, see, you can't actually evade Bruce if you're lucky and or careful. All right. No, no. Right, let me let me show you what sort of um, a late game scenario looks like. Oh, I was not recording then. Huh. Um, yeah, uh, so basically, um, uh, this is a smelter. This is very useful in the uh, more advanced game. Um, you need it to make metal, like uh, for this metal spear. Um, that's a more advanced type of grill. I didn't show you beds before. This is a mechanic, which is a more advanced kind of bed. Uh, that's a sail, of course, that you need to, um, or you don't need it, but you can use it to uh, steer in directions without having to use the paddle. Come here. I appear to have run into an island. Oh, well, that's, that's fine. Anyway, this is Raft. That's all for right now. Until next time, hasta la vista. Adios.